Hello YouTube. Today we're going to be looking at a mechanism I created to store information. It's only one bit for each module, but they only have like three parts. So first you gotta put down an OR gate, then an AND gate, and an inverter. That's pretty simple, but all of the interesting stuff is in the wiring so you gotta go to output and then make the output of the inverter to input two of the AND gate and you make the output of this OR gate to input one of the AND gate and then you gotta make the output of the AND gate input one of the OR gate so now in total there's two empty slots and I'm gonna show you what this does um, someone's being obnoxious with a jeep uh, let's just push that away and uh, you don't need to have a lever you can have a button oh my this person's so obnoxious I'm sorry about that so what each of these empty things does is when the inverter is powered it's the value of this is set to off and when this is powered the value is set to on now if you want to get the output of uh, this memory block you either use the output of the OR gate or the AND gate it doesn't really matter which one and you can see once I press this button it switches on and it stays on now when I click this it turns off and keep setting it to off so this isn't that useful on its own uh, but you can use it with many different things to make it more useful so in the next video I'm gonna be showing you something with it I think I don't know what the next video is gonna be so thanks for watching